44's top 44's reached number 10 in our countdown of the top high school athletes of the sports report decade. Checking at number 10 on the boys countdown, a Coldwater Cavalier with multiple state titles on the gridiron, as well as a gold trophy on the diamond. Brody Hoying, Coldwater, class of 2015, football and baseball. Helped lead the Cavaliers to three straight state football titles starting at quarterback in 2013 and 14. Twice Division V Offensive Player of the Year, two times First Team All-Ohio, special mention All-Ohio in 2012. Three times First Team All-Mac Safety, 2013 MAC Offensive Player of the Year, and First Team All-Mac Quarterback. In baseball, helped lead Coldwater to the state title in 2014, first team All-Ohio in 2015, three times first team All-Mac, 2015 Mac Baseball Player of the Year. When you needed a play, you could, you could, you know, we kind of called it Brody time. It's Brody, it's time. Let's, let's, let's take it over. Because of Brody's position, sometimes those being in his spot really were crucial, crucial times in games that Okay, it's time to make a play. You know, as a sophomore, he, he picks off a pass. When we win 10 to 9, last play of the game in the state final, he wasn't afraid to, 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 you know, get on people and bark at people and say, hey, come on, let's, let's get it going. As a junior, Brody Hoying led the Cavaliers to the state championship game, beating Bishop Hartley in the state title game. They beat the Hawks during the regular season. Now, after that state championship game, the Bishop Hartley coach congratulated Brody and said, hey, we'll see you again next year, and then stopped with a twinkle in his eye said, you know what? No, why don't you run cross country next year? That's a great way to keep your legs in shape for college football. Yeah, he had Division One baseball talent. When you you ask baseball people, uh, a tool guy, he's a five-tool athlete and baseball player. He can run, hit for power, hit for average, play defense, has a great arm. Player that growing up, you could just see it. Again, there's where his speed um, really, really helped because he could, you know, he could he could get on when maybe he shouldn't have gone on, and and of course it's like a double. Uh, senior year, he went in and played second. He pitched some. You know, it's just like, Brody, can you pitch? Well, I can go in there and do that. Yep. And uh, he'd go in there and pitch. And, and uh, again, in those big games, he would, he would, he would make plays to, to, to get those big runs. I, I like watching Brody Hoying play just because he was a football player. And, uh, you know, he played football the right way. And I, I just admired him. Um, you know, we, we had fun going against him because we had really good teams at that time, too. And we matched up. But uh, that, that kid... That kid played football, and I just love to watch him play. His quickness and awareness of where everybody is, especially when he was running the ball, we, we'd always kind of joke like, well, here's the first guy going to tackle him. He, he's, that guy's already, you know, he's already got that guy. He's looking for the next guy. Almost weekly, he would do something in practice, in games, that just like, wow, nobody else can do that. How, how does he do that? So, yeah, pretty special. Hoying is currently playing football for Eastern Michigan as a defensive back. Brody Hoying, number 10 on 44's top 44 male athletes. Hoying, after re-injuring his knee, sat out last season as a redshirt for the Eagles. He'll join us next week as 44's top 44 concludes on Thursday during the sports report. We'll unveil the top female athletes, numbers 9 through 3. On Friday, we'll show you the top boys, 9 through 3. And on Saturday, the final sports report of the season, we'll reveal number 1 and number 2 for both countdowns.